mid laners going to an A and be, being washed out at one split. Actually, that that's one thing that's uh, interesting, Medios, like that people come to NA and they always play worse after their first split. Like Arrow. Arrow came here, he was insane. He was MVP. So good. Mm -hmm. Then he fell off. Sven, he came here, so fucking good. Then he fell off. I think like that happens to a lot of people. They just come and they kind of just like they never get any better. The only exception is Core. I think Core is probably the only import that like came here when he was already pretty good and he got like somehow even better even playing in NA. Confidence playing with him. But uh, yeah, I mean, I swear to God, like even if you do come to NA, I mean, I, you're probably memeing, like you're definitely memeing. But like, if you even if you do come, I I truly think people come here and they think it's gonna be easy, but then they start playing worse and it just becomes like impossible. You know, it's like frustrating. Cause yeah, I mean, it's I think it's pretty normal. Like the solo queue is way worse quality. Uh, you know, you're probably not up against as as strong of teams and scrims too. So. Yeah, yep. I mean, it's tough to keep getting better. Like, a lot of the habits you have that, you know, maybe you need to do something against a better player, and then all of a sudden you're playing against a worse player, you don't have to do it. Like, the skills will slowly fall off. Yeah. Right, that yeah, could, for sure. That could be copium to the max, but I do think people think that it's so easy to be good in NA, but it's actually just as hard, because to be really good in NA, you have to work harder than other yeah. players, because they have Baker better competition. worlds. And LCK so many times, never once won LCS. Exactly. I, I think that He's like crying at night. Good in an A, but like in an A, if that makes sense, you know. Because if if you play against, I mean, you will be as good as your competition sometimes. So if you play against an A teams, you will be as good as your competition is. But that doesn't really mean much when you go to international stage. But uh, at the same time, I think it's also a mindset problem. A lot of pe people that go to NA, they don't, they, they, um, I mean, it's like NA retirement home kind of meme, right? That if you go to NA, you don't go to win, you just go to retire. So then you don't, don't really, well, you just become bad. For example, Alfari, maybe it's too early to say, but I think Alfari was, has been playing very fucking well in NA so far. Yeah. And it's been only one split. So I don't know if he can keep, keep that up for like the next two, three years. But at least for like one split, he was really, really good. And Perix, I think, is pretty good still as well. So, I mean, and, and they went there because they wanted to win, not because they wanted... I mean, of course, there's the mad dollar. Qu involved. 12 million reasons to win. <laughs> 12 million reasons. Why? The Netflix show.